hey guys what's up how's it going welcome back to my channel and today i'm going to be doing a get ready with me video so i have all the things that i'm using here and i will put a screenshot of the products that i'll be using right here um so i'm just i'm just gonna get started with it always moisturize this i use um luscious vanishing cream so if you guys notice i have some really bad acne on my face um i am not an acne person i'm getting really bad hormonal acne so don't mind my acne it does hurt though <laughs> Like, I never was the type to, like, I didn't grow up. Like, even when I went through puberty, acne wasn't my thing. Um, so, I do not like it at all. Make sure to get some on your neck. Moisturize your neck, too, because we put makeup on there. Okay? So, boom, moisturizer. <clears throat> And next thing is primer, and I use Elf's primer. I don't need that much because I usually don't like to put on that much primer because I mean this stuff is already um, pretty. It's a pretty good primer. I don't necessarily like the smell, but I just don't like putting too much because it just makes my face feel really weird, and I feel like it has enough coverage for me. You know, to have all of those things. I wish I would put my phone on silent here. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, so. I'm just gonna put some foundation on. I use, um, this is Sephora's foundation. I talked about this in my other video. I have tried really, really expensive brands and it's hard, oh gosh, please don't tell me I'm out. It's gonna be a disaster. Um, I've used the expensive brands. I've used all of that and it's hard for me to find a foundation that doesn't make my face really, really greasy. Um, that's that's the hard part for me. Um, so with this, I'm actually going to use Sephora. Um, this is their um, Flawless Airbrush. And this is in the, the Pro Flawless Airbrush 56. Ta-da! Um, <clears throat> so there's my foundation. You always want to make sure to blend it into your neck. I feel like ugh, I see so many people and that's such a big like makeup no-no where you literally can see where their makeup or their foundation cuts off on their face and when it meets their neck. So you always want to blend that in because that just don't look right. Right? Right. So now that's done, I'm going to put some corrective concealer on my face. This is Elf's corrective concealer. Um, as you can see, I'm going to be using the green, is that the green one? The green for, um, <clears throat> the, the green for all the red spots, so like my pimples, and just red spaces that I necessarily don't like that I can correct. And I'm going to use the pink for grayer spots, so like underneath um, my eyes. <laughs>
so now that we've blended that on after you put on the corrective concealer you're going to want to put on some actual concealer just you know to blend the actual colors you just put on your face to blend it in with the foundation that you just put on so i'm going to be using this is la girl this is pro conceal all right so ta -da. and that's with the concealer and everything so i'm actually gonna be trying this for the first time on my channel hopefully i don't have a big disaster because i've never done it um I have been using, um, to contour my face, I have been using a contour palette, which is dry. Um, I have been wanting to use a foundation stick. This isn't, this isn't actually a foundation stick. This is a highlight and contour stick by NYX. It is their Wonder Stick, and this is in light medium. So, wish me luck. <laughs> I'm going to try it, and hopefully I like it. So, let's do it. the verdict um <clears throat> i'm actually gonna turn the light on because it's starting to get dark outside um as far as the contouring thing it's not bad um it does still do the job but i feel like it's still not enough so i might go over it with some um with some powder so does that um i set my face with elf's translucent powder and this is in sheer okay so i'm i'm gonna put a little bit of um the contouring powder just because just because it just needs a little bit more sorry i'm using my contour palette as my mirror so I'm gonna brush that out. Yeah, I like I like my contour to be prominent. Um, it's just how I like it. Um, so the next thing I'm gonna put on is I'm gonna put on blush. Um, I'm going to be using Elf's Mellow Mauve, <clears throat> and I will be using um, this Morphe brush. It doesn't have a number because this came in the rose gold set. So I love this brush. Um, and I'm going to be doing my highlighter next. Um, and this is going to be the Morphe palette. This is the um, the Daisy palette. Look how gorgeous it is. Like, hello, come on. Um, I think I'm going to be using... I'm going to be using this bottom left one over here.
with my highlighter today, but that's all right because your highlighter should always be extra, okay? Next thing, eyebrows, bitches. So I'm gonna be using, this is the NYX Tame and Frame. It's the same as the Anastasia Dip Brow. Same stuff, guys. It's just $20 cheaper. Sometimes you have a good eyebrow day, sometimes you don't, and I had a little bit of trouble with my eyebrows today, but that's okay, because it happens. Um, next thing I'm gonna do is I am going to conceal my eyebrows and shape them a little bit. Okay, so there it is. Shaped my eyebrows, done. <clears throat> um, I am going to be putting my eyeshadow on today. I am going to be using BH Cosmetics, and this is their Essential Eyes 28 Color Eyeshadow Palette. Um, and I will be using... <laughs> this is what am I going to be using today? I think I'm going to use this dark brown up here. This dark brown for that. And um, my brow bone is going to be this color right here and my crease color of course is um is mac it's bamboo
that is my eyeshadow looky look. You see, like, highlight the corners of my eyes too to make it. Um, I am not gonna put anything under my eyes. Um, I'm trying to figure out what else I need to do. I think I have done everything. I like to um, set my face before I put any mascara on, or else it'll be everywhere. So I'm gonna use Elf. This is the the Matte Magic Mist and Set. So you're just gonna wanna. Spray that all over. Then I'm gonna put my mascara on. Hey guys, sorry, my camera totally died. Um, but yes, this is the finished look, and I hope you guys like it. Yeah. Um, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't yet, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that like button so you guys can come hang out with me. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.